This is the two-page cheat sheet of the 2024 Handbook for the NRCME, presented by the DSG team, that's the DOT Study Guide team. Your purchase of this and our other educational media products allows us to keep producing and improving the content we provide. This cheat sheet is a student favorite and by itself is worth the cost of this course. While the summarized walkthrough is a more thorough summary of the 2024 handbook, this two-page cheat sheet goes even further, offering only the most vital information compiled into just two pages. This is a very helpful way to quickly review this content before the exam, but also an excellent resource for you to use as a rapid reference when actually performing DOT medical examinations. It is with these benefits in mind that the audio and video versions of this cheat sheet are presented in a very efficient manner, with the video portion being a screen recording of the exact cheat sheet product as it appears in each product package. All right, let's get started. So we'll start with the introduction 0, 0.0, and as we begin, we will mention that there is an abbreviation key to help explain the abbreviations and initialisms found in this cheat sheet as well as in the summarized walkthrough. So with the introduction, the medical examiner must use medical judgment to ultimately determine any individual's qualifications if they are qualified to be a CMV driver, commercial motor vehicle driver. Medical examiners do not diagnose and they do not treat. They simply look to see if there's qualification. There's an overarching set of concepts that need to be addressed and we'll do it here. These are considerations such as determining if the etiology has been confirmed. So have the diagnoses of the causes been confirmed for what is being discussed? Is there a decreased risk of syncope, dyspnea, or collapse? Is there a decreased risk of recurrence of whatever the issue was? What is the nature and severity of the disease and symptoms? Is the patient compliant with their medications or their treatment? Is the treatment proven to be effective and safe and stable? And then remember that every case can be considered case by case, so that there is always medical judgment being used. Section 1.0, FMCSA. With the medical examiner, there are six basic things that the medical examiner must have to be able to perform physical exams for DOT drivers. They need to have their license and have a scope of practice where they can perform physical examinations. They need to know the driver duties and the regulations, and they need to maintain their certification and their national registry listing. A commercial motor vehicle either has the weight or the rating greater than 10,000 pounds, and they are otherwise de described as having design or utilization to carry 9 to 15, that's 1-5, passengers, that's including the driver for compensation, or 16 or more passengers, regardless of compensation. And finally, the other definition that we Thanks for checking out this preview sample of our product content. Make your purchase today and enjoy immediate access to the complete content. Go to our website at www.dotstudyguide.com and purchase your access today. That's www.dotstudyguide.com. Your purchase of this and our other educational media products allows us to keep producing and improving the content we provide.